This video is for those of you who don't like to exercise. So it is super early in the morning and I took my family away for the weekend to a place in nature, as you could see by the trees. And I got up and I left everyone in their warm, cozy beds so I could take this walk. And I did not get up to take this walk because I love to exercise, because guess what? I don't love to exercise. Um, I got up to walk because I know that it's going to lower my inflammation. I know that's going to help my lungs. I have asthma. I know that it's going to help my joints because if you don't use them, you lose them. I know that's going to help prevent dementia and prevent Alzheimer's because exercise does that. I know it's going to reduce inflammation in my body. And I know all this and that's how I get out of bed. And I'm telling you this because sometimes people are like, well, I just don't like to exercise or, you know, you look at others and you think, oh, well, unless I have like this deep desire to exercise, I'm not one of those people. Guess what? I'm not one of those people either. I wake up and I go through the list in my head and I'm like, I need to do this. I need to do this. I need to get up and move my joints and move my lungs and reduce my inflammation. I actually think about this because here's the thing. If somebody said to you, hey, you're sick, here's a list of medication, you need to take them, you would take them. You would take those medications because you'd be like, oh my God, this is life-saving. It's the same thing here. If you want to help prevent ever getting that list of medication, you have to move. That's part of the prescription. So when you wake up in the morning you're like, oh, I don't want to get out of bed, you have to remind yourself, I don't want to be on medication when I get older. I don't want to lose my memory when I get older. I don't want to lose my ability to move when I get older. And let that be the motivator to get you out of bed. Don't look for that, you know, elusive love of exercise. Not everyone has that. I don't have it. I get up because I think of these things and I'm like, okay, let's do it. And I take it just as, you know, like a prescription. Like this is what I need to do to prevent disease. Anyway, as I huff and puff through this hill, I just wanted to share that with you so you could see the reality behind exercise. It's not always cute and it doesn't require a fancy outfit. I'll talk to you soon.